one of the yeah. best I've heard in terms of just dudes on a game. <laughs> it, it felt good hearing my name. Though. He, he's like, here comes Mike. Oh, they on the outside. Mike on the outside. <laughs> totally. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that That's Daytona race is still the most viewed race on there. I remember I, I, had, I had the pole, led the whole first stage, led some of the second stage. I had a good car. I was so mad when I messed up in pits. Mm. What car I decided you? to go in the back and all my RPM and smoke and all these idiots and man, uh, uh, riding like clowns. <laughs> my RPM, I raced it before. Who that same man? I knew all of them. Like I did Who that same was was in our league the first the first season. Who that same? Yeah, he was in our drive like an idiot too. I remember him. That's why he. That's why him and Mark Mike Arpin left the league. And then they started having some of the Xfinity dudes like Jay Hyper and some of these other dudes come up in the cup. And they, they fucked all the cup races up. I remember, they, I remember they kicked me out. They didn't even give me a reason for why they kicked me out. They just kicked me out. Yeah, I, I guess what I wish the guys that was over in FTRL was running this league because everybody was friendly, man. Everybody got along. Yeah, man. Like on here, like like you, even even when those two guys, Green and Message, just came in, you, you could tell the awkwardness. It's still awkward. Damn. It's heated animosity, like bro. It's like we here to have fun. It's a video game, dude. Like, I don't care about like, bro. I just want like, bro. Let's just get up here, race, have some fun. I'm making three wide. Oh, look at Terrell making it three wide. Look at his dumb ass. Like, dude. If you make it three wide, shit. Got, that's what's fun. That's what I laughed at. Like, it's a NASCAR guy giving right. And he does it bad. I'm like, and he does it literally in the next corner. Like, dude, what are you talking about? <laughs> so it's good for you. It's not good for the flock. Like, <laughs> now, he he calls for that, man. Like, all, like, it's it like it's just awkward, man. Like, I mean, you yeah, have I like, I like the fun. fact. Yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong. I like the fact that we we doing the sixteen player chat, but you can tell it's 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 awkward, man. Like, so we, Dude, we hopped in the we hopped in the party. Everybody was hella quiet. Like, nobody yeah. said nothing for like five minutes. Like, what the fuck? Like, I ain't never been in a league like that where you just get in a party and nobody's talking. Like usually when I've been in leagues where dudes are just they won't fucking shut up. I rather have that <laughs> than just be sign like size is golden. <laughs> yeah, I'm in league dudes where I remember this Discord chat that me and Alex was in, bro. Oh my god, these dudes would not shut up. <laughs> I rather had them. I, I don't know. I rather had them talking than, like I said, just not saying shit at all. It, 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 it makes the room feel weird, man. Only want to talk when you when you get into them. Why right. That's my bomb. Pretty much it. Oh, yeah. On, like, that's bro. the only. That that's how it is with the message board. Nobody don't say nothing about the message board. I think the whole week it be silent, and then when something happens on the track, that's when they get in the message board. They be like, "Oh, you got you, you know, you ran into me or whatever." And I'm like. Oh, so you want to now? You want to message? Now you want to say something? You don't want to address it in the party. You know what? <laughs> that that's why I, I, I. That's what I'm saying. Like me and me and Mess, we we kind of got into it about this thing with Trump and what he did, and I I hope he don't bring that shit over to to the to the party chat. Mm, I don't play hearing that. I hope he don't either, bro. I ain't even trying to hear that. Don't blame. Please don't bring politics into racing, dude. This what fucked it up in the beginning. This what fucked it up in real life. This was fucked it up in the video game. Please don't. I, I, Please I, will, don't. I will leave a party and not care during the race. I will too. They used to do that on Grand Turismo. Not messing up, but it was like Evo OGR guys. Or I was, other guys. Like they, they were bringing, they were talking about. You know, I listen to some music. Yeah, them OGR guys, they, they, they used to bash Obama. They used to bash the shit out of him. I mean, why, why we're racing? Yeah. I'm not one of them. T like, bro, I don't give a fuck. Like, I can speak on politics. I mean, I understand what's going on. But I, I don't care enough to. It's like, <laughs> right. dude, we're, we're here like, racing. Uh, why, are you, why are you trying to make this about politics? Like, 
Let's talk about tires and fuel and draft. <laughs> yeah, oh, right. <laughs> Aerodynamics. Let's talk about battling on our track. Damn it, let's, 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 let's talk about five lug nuts and how spectacular they are. I'm gonna talk about this for about an hour. I remember me and Wes and he too, man. We used to be in leagues where it was it was fun. Like we used to battle. It was fun. Well, yeah, yeah, we had awesome battles. I might have them on. I, well, I probably did stream it. I don't I know some, which one yeah. they are. But I think it was where it's at Vegas. Well, me and you, at, I think it was me, you, and SGT, I think. Blood Splat, I don't know if you remember well, we were like, Yeah, I do. Well, we were like side yeah. by side for like 20 laps. Yeah, that shit was fun as hell. That was one of the funnest battles I had on the track. That shit was so fun. It was one race at Kansas, too, under the lights with the trucks. Fun as hell. We were three, four wide. That's what I miss, man. I haven't felt that feeling on this game in so long. Just having fun. First time always... I met you, all of a sudden, when things are down. <laughs> right. Yeah. I, didn't even, I didn't even know you. So you, you know, you got this lead, to be honest. We all I mean, I'm I'm freak of project young car, man. Yeah, yeah, I seen you in Project Star. I was like, dude, who's this fast ass dude, man? Like, I remember you had said some fast ass. I was like, fuck, man. I said, I seen about you, Terrell, man. So, who the fuck is this Terrell, nigga, man? <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, man. I thought you was a kid at first, man. I saw the boy, uh, the boy, a young boy. I'm like, oh, this probably some type of kid. Uh huh. Yeah. No, I forgot. I should have bitched. I met that name when I first got on here. I should have been changing, but I never got the chance to. Everybody was changing their shit, so I was like, I don't know. Because I was uh, having trouble recognizing people's names because everybody was changing to something completely different. Yeah, I know. I don't even know what else I would want to name, man. I like mine. I don't want to. Yeah, yours is cool. That's a unique yeah. ass, cool ass name. I mean, you. Your name is what you do in real life, so. Yeah. You're pro bowler. Oh, I didn't even know that. <laughs> well, I don't know why I thought you said I'm going to my bowler class. I, I thought he was joking. He was serious. That nigga was dead serious, man. <laughs> I had a tournament this morning, actually. <laughs> What's this one? Your name, you should rename it to Kicking Ass at Bowl in 1989. <laughs> or, or I could change it to bro, Pro Bowler 300 now. Oh yeah, you yeah. can do that. You you, you did you did ball three hundred. Yeah. You sure did. What a perfect game. Mm -hmm. Damn. Yeah. Damn. Took me twenty six years to do it, and then I got my second one two weeks <laughs> after that. I ain't catch yeah, close enough. I get some strikes, but I ain't like that. <laughs> you started bowling. You was like what? Four. 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 Damn. Jesus. Damn boy. Yeah. You you never thought about <clears> getting the, getting the PBA? I would like I would like to, but I don't have the money to even get in it. Like, it, it I know it like... caught, a lot of the PBA regional stuff. It costs like well, there was one event that I could have went to that I could have tried out for, but it cost like almost five hundred dollars to get in or something. Wow. And it was in Vegas. That's where most of the the big stuff is. I yeah, watch I just... it on TV all the time. Which I thought was pretty cool because with Watkins Glen being the go bowling at the Glen when I went, I got to meet one of the bowlers that was there in the pit area and they had the whole bowling tent and stuff with a couple of lanes there were, had this little segments and stuff where he came out and did stuff and El Marola was out there with him and Eric El Marola? Yeah. Damn he's responsible about him. It's crazy, and I just seen the Twitter. It's like 40, 41 days from the 500. It's like such a quick ass turnaround. Mm -hmm. That's gonna I change soon. What you mean? They trying to make the off season a little longer. They trying to oh. end the season a little earlier. They trying to end it like around late September, early October. I was just crying at Halstead. And now I'm about to be excited. I don't like that. The reason they doing that is because they don't want to be in the mix when NFL is happening. That's because they ratings are so shitty. Because they, it's because they on track product. Like that's why they want to, they want to change everything besides the damn racing. Like oh, I, know, I know they going to a new car. But, I mean, I know they going. To, I get it. I mean, you're not gonna supersede the NFL. It don't matter what racing do. But I mean, why would? How does that? I don't know. How does that help your brand by going? To, what is less? <laughs> they think less is more in their in their eyes. I guess they think less is more. Or they just want to end it. Oh, I, I don't think it's a terrible move. They'll make you hung, more hungry for NASCAR. Oh, yeah. during the off season. 
instead of it coming around so quickly. I was just frustrated like a couple months ago because the damn racing was shitty all year. And now we already a month away from the final hunt. Two and a half months is pretty. I mean, that's that's a decent amount. It's probably it's more than that. I think it's three months. Cause you start you start mid middle of November to mid middle of February. Yeah, about three yeah. months. Now but the main race. reason they're doing this though because uh, team of us. I mean, people are working ten out of the twelve months throughout the year. So it's like. Not like media members, team members, the drivers. I mean, they doing it for them as well. And I think the drivers know, ain't got no excuse. I mean, you getting paid millions of dollars. Like, I don't really feel that bad for you. Yeah, the, the teams, crew members, the teams yeah. are working all year round. Yeah, the pit crew members, the teams, they are working the shops to fix on them cars. Mainly them. Is what I'm yeah, those. I get that. I truly get that. But everybody else. I mean, come on. Man, they spend time with their coochies, spend time with their families, drivers spend time with their families, and you got the guys just at the shop constantly. If I was them, NFL, though, how about them Titans? Oh, God. We knew was going to come with this BS. <laughs> I'm just glad that I don't have to worry about seeing the Patriots on Super Bowl Sunday anymore. What are you telling? Shit. I don't think nobody want to see that. Nobody, nobody want to see that. I want to see my homes in the Super Bowl. My cousin's a Chiefs fan, and uh, I think it'd be pretty cool to have at least one of both of our teams in uh, the AFC Championship game, and at least I'll... Y'all got a know. tough, tough yeah, game. Yeah, I'm more worried about the Ravens than I was with the Patriots. I had a feeling we would beat the Patriots. I didn't think it was going to be that close. I actually thought Titans could have beat them a lot more than that, but that little that was a little scary, that entire game. I didn't like it too much. That was a little nerve-wracking. I mean, if you're going to have Belichick with his stupid ass to allow Henry to go for damn near 200 yards on the ground, you're not going to beat nobody. I mean, nobody. I, I, I get people with bash on Brady, but it's like, dude, like, no quarterback's going to beat a team if, you, if your defense is giving that up every game. You're just not beating anybody. And, that's what, that. and they're talking about the Patriots, the best one of the, uh, the best defense in the league. Well, that, 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 that shows their weakest schedule. And it, they had the weakest schedule, probably the NFL, they and usually do. people were like, "Oh, they're the best defense ever!" And then they play the Ravens, the Chiefs. They get beat by the Dolphins, the fall is two seed or three seed, and then they get beat by the Titans by Henry running all over them. Yeah, I'm like, "Where's that defense you're talking about?" See what happens when you play real teams. That was the beginning of the end when they lost to the Dolphins. That's a team you should little, never. Leave. Little shit talking. <laughs> I feel he, he, he I'm going on a feel rant pain. I know you gotta feel this pain his Titans ain't never did nothing it's been years since they did shit so I get it was it. 2000 I think 2000 or 2001 when they were in the Super Bowl and lost did, didn't y'all have Steve, Mc, Steve McNair at the time yeah, yeah. McNair and Eddie Rams? George against the Rams I think yeah the toy hey, hope, no. it's been that long shit yeah Dale Singer was still alive at that point I still Damn. remember that play too. That 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 throw. That one he, one yard short. Yeah, when he tried to reach for the end zone, he was one yard short. I still remember that play. That was an iconic play. Iconic stop. I tried being a Bills fan. Them motherfuckers. Oh, I, I wonder who's alive. Who was alive then at that point where they went to I think four straight Super Bowls and lost all four. Of them. <laughs> yeah, I or saw a thing. Like that. I saw a thing that said the Bills still remain the only team to make four straight Super Bowls since the Patriots are out. No, I lost all of them. And how do you get you get to the grandest stage and you lose every single time? I'll be slapping the shit out of the coach. <laughs> I was hoping the Bills were going to win that game. I don't have to worry and worry about the Texans either. We already faced them twice a year. I don't want to face them again. Yeah, they know y'all. But I well. think the Chiefs are going to beat them. They're ready. Like I said, y'all, y'all, y'all gonna have y'all hands full of Lamar Jackson. They're, they're yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm a little. Yeah. That's if crazy. They buy the... that. They beat the Chiefs this year, so I know they can do that. The Ravens is the only one that scares me right now if they get I past that, that end up being the chief. yeah that was a good game man i don't know how they pulled that, that ending, one off i was pissed that ending was such bs i mean because i remember Holmes threw for like 450. He well was that blocked field goal yeah 
because they were they when they went I think they he was coming off a knee injury and they, I mean Tannehill going down the field scored so I, I wasn't I mean I, I ain't I wasn't a, I ain't no Titans hater I ain't no Chiefs fan it's just like damn it was a good ass game I just didn't expect it to go like that I didn't expect see I didn't expect to win that one I knew that was gonna be a tough game I wasn't expecting them to win that one it's a new age though whoa, in football whoa, whoa. yeah you never know anything. Oh Most of the, my God! I was so I, I, I didn't was I didn't on that one. I, I wasn't saying whoa for me. Uh, mess mess got. I guess he got too no, tight. And he smacked that wall. It's a new age. Most of the fucking best quarterbacks is black now. Lamar Jackson, Pat Mahomes, Deshaun Watson, three That's of the racist. three of the four. I'm just Nah. I'm just it's a new age though, really. I, I, can't, I can't remember the last time this many. Hey, y'all know, 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 know who, who I got to thank? Who? Real talk. Dale Earnhardt Jr. I'll never get that shit, that? You, that shit you told me, nigga. And Jonah Hill. Jonah, I'll never get that. <laughs> that uh, shit was what, funny. Wait, what? <laughs> nah, I was, getting, I was doing a little skit from uh, J. Cole album. Oh. Uh, he said, going? Dale Earnhardt Jr. For me to you, dog. That, that shit you told me changed my life. <laughs> and Jonah Hill, Jonah Hill, that shit you told me—I'll never get this shit in the elevator. Nah, I'm sorry, just... bullshit. I don't know that them niggas. I like. I mean, I heard that one driver that Eric, that even the other athletes and different they, they know about Earnhardt. <laughs> he that one dude in racing that everybody know about. Even some of the casuals know. Yeah, yeah, man. They they took a damn picture together, J Cole and uh, uh Dylan Hart. Mm -hmm. It's the reason why he made the most money. He wasn't damn, great! Driving. What was that about? Oh, dude, pulling in thirty million plus, only winning one race a year. And I ain't even hate him. I like Junior. Yo, Green, what was that about, man? That was an accident, dude. Damn, calm down. The sport took a precipitous drop off when he left. The oh, sport you're making too. me go through these restarts. It's killing me. I'm not going to send no message, man. I ain't got time for that. I mean, he just put me in the wall, man. Sad. Hopefully, hopefully one day. These Billy and them ain't in the race shit. Are they allowed to run in the other series? I hope not. What are you talking about? I ain't, I ain't trying to get hit in the back today and have to deal with something. Yeah, I'll tear out. I don't want to hear somebody talking like that all night. Oh, no. They they weak ass. It's not going to be in. I hope not. This Kuala will run. That. That's what I wish I would have said. This Kuala will run him on the controller anyway. Don't, don't worry about it. You did it last week, so. Yeah. That's what uh, I found so funny. You know, first talking to you. I ain't, I ain't even seen your back. That's what I should have said, like, nigga. I ain't even We're seen your back ring. bumper yet. And you over here running your mouth. <laughs> I don't want to talk about that last week, man. I had a top five ride. Fucking power, man. <laughs> you, shit, I did too, man. We both did. I don't like that bottom on the restart, man. Damn, he got right into me, man. He was running me over a little bit too last week. I ain't even say shit. I love fun. Funny, it's like, dude, when I was getting ran over, I didn't even say nothing. They get ran over, they start spewing at the mouth. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's how they do. And yeah, like, bro, I got bumped. Oh man, he just run me the fuck over. I ain't even saying shit. That's how me and probably bro. That's how we was in other leagues. Like, dude, I, I'm here. I'm gonna get fucking ran the fuck over. I wouldn't even say nothing. That's what I say, man. Like this, this group right here, man. It's it's been controversy every season. The past two seasons, it's, it's been controversy. Whoever got some problems, need to. That's how we was at the end of our leagues. Usually at our in our season, we'd be like, yo, if whoever got problems, they need to go on a party and talk about it. Like, man, if y'all don't, that's we gonna have to like kick y'all out or some shit. Cause that's the problem. That's they, every time we try to invite them, they don't never want want to join. They always want to just pout, fold their arms. That that that's why when when messing them when they they join this the party chat, you see why you see I don't say nothing. I just be quiet for the first couple of minutes. I don't say nothing. I didn't say shit either. 
Yeah, because I want to see what they're going to say first before I open my mouth. Because I know, I, know, I know how I am. I, everybody knows how I am. First thing I did was apologize when I got in the rush because it was such, such minimal such minimal contact. So I was like, yo, my bad. I didn't mean to hit you, bro. Man, of course, they don't he hit still passed like a little bitch about it. I was going to say, they don't want to hit that shit. They don't. He still hit me, you dumbass. I mean, calling people out their names and shit. It's like, it's not even called for. They do. Like, bro, if I really want to fuck you, oh, 3D, no. I'm like, bro, if I really want to run you the fuck over, I'll run you over. That, that, that ain't nothing, dude. I like how you changed that up. <laughs> what? He said, if I really want to fuck you, if I really want to run you over. <laughs> Yo, yeah. I mean, yeah, I, yeah, I switched that shit up, no homo. <laughs> Uh, be honest, I be hating that shit too with my friends when they be like to them when I say some shit like that may sound home. I'm like, dude, first off, why are you even thinking like that like, when I do say it like that? Why, oh, you, why you thinking like that? Hey, Lee, you want to tell them my bro? CTK? <laughs> yeah, you ain't gonna like my brother then. My oldest yeah. brother. Uh huh. You say one small thing that sound homo. He be like, oh, uh, uh, oh, what you talking about, man? Hey, on, your off, <laughs> on your off time, you be thinking about dicks or something? Like, damn. <laughs> the moment I say something, you're going to be like, damn, dude, that's gay. Nah. <laughs> it, I, I, I mean, I'll be like, I'll be busting my friend's balls about that shit, too. Like, Nigga, that oh, shit gay see? as fuck. Busting your friend's balls? Yeah. That's what you're doing now? Here we go. <laughs> that's what you're doing, man? Yeah, yeah, they, yeah my friend, he, he was on me about that, too, when I said that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you looking at you look you looking at uh, big boy balls all day? Be busting <laughs> niggas balls all day? No, that's what you're doing, huh? Yeah. Hey man, pause you real quick, man. What you doing? Man? I remember one time I was on a, <laughs> I was at, <laughs> we had some basketball. My partner of mine, he was like, he was like, let's stretch the defense out. <laughs> Oh, it was just like, bro, what? What did you do? Because everybody thought he said something. I was like, what did you just say? I said, I want to stretch the defense. <laughs> oh, stop. Oh, stop. Yo, we can like, Yo. Oh, man. <laughs> I want to stretch the D out. I was like, whoa. Oh, no. No, <laughs> No, sir. He's like, no, bro. I didn't mean it like that. I meant it like. <laughs> right. He tried to change it up and shit. Like, nah, nigga, that's what you meant. You want to stretch that D, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I got some crazy man. When I was in high school, I had some stupid, crazy ass friends doing dumb shit. I mean, I told y'all that before. I hate people that straight that that's heterosexual that be trying to act gay. Like that shit weird to me. Bro. I I've <laughs> never done that shit. Talking about dudes that try to be all like this dude like just trying to make gay jokes. Like bro, like that shit. Like I remember we was in a party and. It, wasn't it messing one of them that was doing that shit and was saying gay shit back, back and forth in the chat to each other? I ain't got nothing to on gay people, but I said, I said, I said, what? He's the main one that says stuff like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna, oh, I gotta go get fucked in the ass real quick. Like, dude, what? What are you talking about? Were you molested as a child or something? Like, why are you, you remember this on your memories or some shit? People <laughs> say shit like that. Like, you're straight, dude. Why do you say stuff like that? <laughs> I get it's a joke, bro. <laughs> I don't know. Like, you wouldn't break the ice with that with some new person. Like, yo, what's up, man? I like getting fucked in the ass. Like, it's just gonna come off weird. Gonna come off very chirping. Boy, like, what the fuck this nigga talking about? The problem isn't gay people. It's heterosexual people acting gay. Straight people. It's acting funny. It's weird. Yeah, they've been, they've been Y'all mm -hmm. don't find that shit weird, like, bro. What's wrong with y'all? I'm sure y'all got girlfriends. What the fuck, like, the fuck, y'all talk like that. For, I mean, let me not, let me not get in that much confidence. They probably don't, but who knows? Excuse me, guys. I go, I go, I gotta go. Dick to somebody, like, nigga, what? He said what? what? It, exactly. What, what he said. I, it just, I, ain't, I don't want to repeat it now. I think it one time. I'm saying, yeah. like, I remember this one dude. I think his name was AJ Storm, bro. He was in Midnight. This dude used to send black cocks in the chat, bro. He what? And I remember oh, no, he was sending pictures of black cocks in the message chat. And he got, I remember somebody reported it. 
and they got him kicked out of the pro series because of that. I think it was oh, some dude they, named uh, they've, they've done that shit Chris in Morris. Too. Yeah, What's, they suspended. Wait, they sus what was his name? It was this dude named Chris Morris that got him suspended because he was doing that shit in the chat. Chris, it was this dude, Chris Morris. He like he is some he's some fucking. He's some fucking uh, dude that used to run vent this vent league called Vintage or some shit with Scout Bonk and uh, some of these other dudes over there. He fucking um, unemployed, living off, living off fucking unemployment checks and shit. He he didn't we didn't really we didn't like him, but that's what he because it was a league. It was a league that was called Impact recently that had all the Pro Series dudes in it, and they both branched out. One of them they did. Some of the drivers went to Vintage, and the other drivers went to uh, Midnight Broadcasting. So. Everybody split up. Huh? Everybody split up, huh? Yeah, because they was having problems with each other. Morris was having problems with a couple of dudes and how they was running shit. They were talking shit back and forth with each other, so they ended up splitting up and breaking the teams in half. Breaking the little leagues in half, whatever. And Midnight was doing way better, so. Like I said, Morris is one dude. I mean, I... What's the dude's name? Yeah, fuck, he, he's in the Pro Series. Jr. Too. Chris Morris Jr. Yeah, it was this dude. I was in a chat with him, talking to him. He was talking, talking, telling, telling me and somebody else about it. This is this dude's name? That dude's he's racist. in the Pro Series. He's in the Pro. This is dude who's in the Pro Series. He was trying to. I gotta go down. His, I think his name is Jason Keffler now. Jason Keffler or some shit. It used to be WVU fan. But he changed it to, I think in the pro series, he's, he's called something else now. Wait, that was but, WVU fan, that Keffer from the league? I remember that WVU, or WVU Mountaineers or something. It was WVU fan, WVU something, I don't remember what it was, but it was WVU. And he used to, he was telling me all about it, he was like, this dude's un unemployed, he lives off unemployment checks, he was just going in on this dude. Just going straight in. He did not like, he did not like dude. Yeah, Morris, Morris Jr., though. Know, I know you're talking about. I, it's Gamer Tag's name, Morris Oh, Jr. my God. That dude is a racist, man. Him and, uh, um, him and, and, and Dispute. Yeah, two racist fucks. Man, I can't believe this. I think I'm one of them. I think Morris one time, he was like, I can't believe these, these, these niggers are talking to me like this. And I was just like, dude. <laughs> See? He I started him. laughing. I thought the shit was funny as hell. I don't. People may say, oh, "How you black and why do you find that funny?" I just, I don't know. This shit, ignorance is that. People's ignorance be funny to me sometimes. Like, like how, like, bro, you, it, it's 2020, bro, and you still act like that. <laughs> That's still your mindset. Yeah, I've been, I've been in recovery call racing. I've seen so many racist dudes on here to be running their fucking mouth. Mm -hmm. It don't matter. I don't. It's something you expect. What's up, Inners? <clears throat> Where are we again in the Xfinity? Dollar 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 Dollar. Who making the lobby?